chaos for commuters in North Carolina. Some slipped and slid home with a little help. Others abandoned their cars for the night. Before the snow arrived, freezing rain encased these roads in a layer of ice, making driving particularly treacherous. At least 10 people have died across the south because of the extreme weather. More than 3,000 flights have been cancelled. State services swung into action. Lessons had been learned after authorities in Georgia were accused of being unprepared when an ice storm struck two weeks ago, stranding thousands. This time, people were taking no chances. Georgians have heeded the warning and they are staying home and staying off the roadways. And that is appreciated by all of us who are trying to keep everybody safe. Some did venture out to enjoy the snow in the normally mild south. The storm is now bearing down on states further north, where cities from Baltimore to Boston are expecting up to 20 centimetres of snow. Beth McLeod, BBC News, Washington.